there's one. You hit it right at the boat. Oh. Here we go guys, there's a good look at that fish. First one of the day. Got out here, it's about 7.30. I'm gonna be doing a little morning fishing and uh, then uh, my buddy's coming with uh, his girlfriend and we're gonna do a little uh, 2v2 tournament of our best five. Uh, I'm gonna go ahead and get a quick little weight on this fish. Just got this new scale yesterday. I'm gonna guess like one seven. One pound, 13 ounce right there. Almost two pounds. Gonna go ahead and get a little uh, picture for Snapchat and then release him. There he goes. All right guys, so uh, you saw me just catch that fish. We have a huge problem. Uh, I brought five rods with me, and uh, fish that I just caught, can't find the rod, so pretty sure it's in the water, and I'm going to have to go in for it, or else I'm out 200 bucks, and this lake is recycled sewage water, this sucks. Alright guys, here we go, getting in to go for my rod, this is awesome, won't be able to get it on camera, but uh I'll let you, let you guys know how it goes. All right, quick update. Been looking for about 10 minutes. Still no sign, but I'm gonna be in here until I find it, so. Yeah, sucks. All right, guys, as you can see, I'm back in the boat. Still don't have the rod yet, but I have a better idea. I'm going to uh, take my uh, 7.3 heavy frogging rod and just go through the bottom on my boat and just drag it around and hopefully I'll like feel it and then I'll get to jump back in again and go get it. All right, well, uh, that was a terrible idea. Can't really feel anything, just a bunch of weeds. I don't know what my rod would feel like, so I'm gonna have to keep swimming down for it. Guess what, guys? Finally found it. Took about probably 20 minutes to half an hour, but it was worth it. Just gonna jump back on and keep fishing. That was awesome. Nice. Oh, no! I'm coming after this dude. Another cast in the bush. Got him that time. Oh, I swear every time I cast in that bush, he hit it. Oh, that's a good one. That's a good fish. Freaking choke the frog, that's what I'm talking about. Out, you're good. Just lift right up. That's a chunky dude, I say he's a good two and a half. Go ahead and get a weight on him really quick. Ah! Oh, whew, chill. Two pounds, nine ounces. Not a bad one. Here he goes. Chill, chill. Oh, 
Got you that time. Another, another one on the frog. It's about 8.30 and they're still hitting the frog. Freaking pumped. There he is, nice little dude. Go ahead and get a release. Step on, dude. Oh, there you go, guy. Oh, poor duck. Thing looks like it's about to die. Oh, that's a freaking dink. Oh, there you go. This is a chunky dude. Probably go for about a pound. Anyways, here he goes. I'll release him over here. Alright, there you go. <laughs> All right guys, wrapping up the video here. I guess you could say it was a pretty eventful day. I caught uh, four or five fish off frogs. They were pretty much hitting it all morning, so it was a cool little bite. Um, but I'm actually gonna keep fishing, but I'm ending this video here. I'm gonna do a little uh, tournament. My uh, buddy Dakota is gonna come on the boat, and uh, we're just gonna do a uh, best five, just a little tournament against each other. So uh, yeah, ending this video here, but uh, by the time you're watching this, there's a good chance that that video is already up. So if you want to go check that out, I'll uh, probably have a link in the description or something like that. Anyways, uh, hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll catch you next time.